Namaste and welcome. We've made it to the last chakra, Sazrar, and this lesson is a, is a very particular class. So we have moved from the earth, the material world, the body, all the way up to our spiritual realm. We have built and deepened awareness and focus. And in this class, we are going to open our seven chakra in order to reach that state of wonderful bliss. When the seven chakra is open, we might be able to experience samadhi, which is basically a state of deep inner peace and perfection. So in this class, which is an inner reprogramming class, we'll go through a very, very slow flow. We'll bring awareness to each single micro movement and we'll try to match, think, breath and movement. Remember always to fully breathe in and fully breathe out. So we're going to use the full yogic breath as a reminder, as a tool which will help us stay focused on the present moment. I'm here right now. So come to a comfortable seated position, finding your base, lengthening the spine. Lift your shoulders up, back and down. Keep the chest open. Long neck, shoulders relaxed. Crown to the sky. So Sazrar is basically here, is our crown center. on the top of your head. And take a moment to connect with your breath. Deep inhale all the way down to your first chakra, Muladhar. Breathing out, all the way out, 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 out. And when you inhale, notice the expansion in your belly, in your rib cage, in your chest. And on the exhalation, your chest, rib cage, belly, drop. Slowly bring palms to your chest, thumbs to your heart, and we'll open the practice with the OM. Breathing in to begin. Oh.
Gently open your eyes. So we have learned that each chakra has a Bija Mantra. So from the first to the sixth, we have learned the seed mantra. But for the seventh chakra, there is no Bija Mantra because Sasra means completion, means full perfection. Infinite petals. infinite bliss. Extend your arms on the mat. Inhale to raise your arms up. Slowly, 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 slowly. Start activating your shoulders. And exhale to slowly, slowly, slowly release all the way down. Let's do this a few times, focusing on micro movements, focusing on here and now. Full yogic breath. Inhale as you lift. No rush. Exhale to slowly push your arms down. And start noticing the activation in your arms, in your hands, in your shoulders. Keeping your face relaxed. Shoulders relaxed. And if you notice any tension Use your breath to soften that tension. Last three rounds. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up, last time, and exhale all the way out. 
Release your hands, lengthening the neck, rest your shoulders. Deep inhale, long exhale. Take your left hand on your right knee. Place your right hand behind your back to lift your back. Crown to the sky, lengthening the spine. And twist. Look over your right shoulder. Five breaths here, big twist, and slowly release to the other side, lift your spine, crown to the sky, and twist, look over your left shoulder, five breaths here, And slowly release both hands on your knees. And let's start with big circles from the left to the right, all the way back. Inhale. When you move forward, exhale on the way back. Very slow movement. And moving in the opposite direction. And if your mind starts wandering, gently take it back to your breath and return to the center, keeping your spine straight. Softening your neck. So a few rounds, head rotation, very slow movement, doesn't matter which direction you choose, we're going to do both sides, really pay attention to those little aches in the neck in the shoulder and be gentle very gentle other side slowly slowly And 
coming back to the center. Place your right hand on your left ear, keeping the spine straight, both shoulders relaxed. No pressure, just a very slight invitation for your left neck to stretch. So don't pull just be gentle. And slowly release other side. Gently place your left hand on your right ear. Without pulling, without forcing the stretch, just stay here. With time and love, will soften all the tensions. And slowly release. Coming to tabletop position. So Hands on the shoulders, knees on the hips. A few rounds of Marjari Asana. So very, very slowly. We're going to inhale to arch the back, open the chest, drop the belly. And exhale, exhale, exhale to draw the belly in, curve the spine, draw the chin to the chest. And again, Focus on the micro movements. Start activating your hands on the mat. Your glutes. When you draw your belly in, you can also squeeze your glutes. Full yogic breath. Last three rounds.
Return to the center. One breath here. And from here, step your hands forward. We're going to inhale, exhale, and then come all the way back. Inhale, exhale. And back to the center, tuck your toes and find your first downward facing dog. Rotate your inner thighs internally to get your belly closer to your thighs. Lift your tailbone to the sky. Lift your heels as well, keeping your knees bent. Breathing in and out here. Inhale. And on the next exhalation, lengthen the heels towards the ground. Pressing hands, pressing your feet. Couple of breaths here. And slowly walk your feet between your hands. Uttanasana. From here, lengthen the spine. Hands on the mat or on your shins. Really lengthening the spine, shoulders away from ears. And exhale to lower. Option to bend your knees. And once again, inhale to lengthen the spine. Exhale to lower. Inhale to come all the way up, raise your arms, slight back bend, exhale, Namaskara Mudra, Tadasana. to lock your fingers behind your head, open your chest. We're going to do Chandrasana, side stretch, inhale in the center, exhale on the side.
last three on each side. Inhale in the center, exhale, release your arms, bend your knees, Uttanasana. Inhale to lengthen your spine, exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale to unroll and come to standing. Inhale, raise your arms up, Urdhvastasana. Exhale, option to bend your knees, Uttanasana. Inhale, Ardha Uttanasana, lengthening that spine. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, come all the way up, Urdhvastas. Exhale, Namaskara Mudra. Release. Inhale, Urdhvastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, Urdhvastasana. Exhale, Namaskara Mudra Tadasana. Inhale, exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, all the way up. Exhale, Namaskara Mudra, and release, and stay here in Tadasana for a moment, notice the prana, the energy flowing through your body, and try to do this last three rounds with your eyes closed, just follow my voice, follow my cues, and try to really enter this flow through your body, through the mind, become one with this flow. Inhale, Urdhvastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale to slowly unroll your spine. Raise your arms, Urdhvastha. Exhale, Namaskara Mudra. And Tadasana. A couple of breaths here. Inhale, Urdhvastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, Ardha Uttanasana. 
Exhale, Uttana. Inhale, all the way up. Exhale, Namaskara Mudra. Finding land in your spine, in your neck, shoulders down, face relaxed. Release to Dadasana. Last round. I'm present to myself. I inhale Urdvastasana. Exhale Uttanasana. I inhale Ardhatanasana. Exhale Uttanasana. Inhale, come all the way up. Exhale, Namaskara Mudra. And stay here with your eyes closed. And soak up this sensation of enormous well-being, of stillness in the body, in the mind. Slowly release your hands, open your eyes. So inner reprogramming is basically like a meditation movement. We bring awareness to each single micro movement, each single part of the breath in the inhalation, in the exhalation. So from here, make sure that your heels are in line with your knees and your hips and your shoulders. So one line. We're going to work on balance. So basically, shift all your weight on your left foot. And from here, we are going to lift the right leg. And both arms. Inhale. Exhale. So very, very slowly. And then on the other side. Find a point of focus for your gaze. It will help maintain the balance. Or if you feel comfortable and if you've tried this before, you can try to close your eyes. So inhale as you lift. Full yogic breath. Exhale, slowly release, no rush, so your foot will reach the floor when your arms reach your thighs. In, exhale, inhale, and exhale. And see if you can lift a bit further up your knee as you continue in this flow. Three more rounds on each side.
last round. And slowly return to the center. Mm, couple of shoulder movements to rotating opposite direction. And from here we're going to do a very slow standing twist. So inhale to raise your arms, exhale. Keeping the crown to the sky, the core slightly engaged. Feel the twist. Last three rounds on each side. And return to the center. Inhale, raise your arms up. And exhale, lower. Inhale to lengthen your spine. Exhale to lower. Inhale to unroll and come all the way up to standing. Inhale, raise your arms up. Exhale, lower. Step back. Find your downward facing dog. Big stretch. Five long breaths here. Inhale, come into plank. Exhale, lower forehead on the mat. Inhale for cobra. Opening the chest. Exhale, downward facing dog. Big stretch. Now lower your knees. Left ankle out of the mat. Extend your right leg. Foot is in line with the edge of your mat. Left hand under your shoulder. Inhale. Slowly, slowly, slowly reach with your right arm over your head. Look up to the sky, keep your chest open and exhale, 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 micro movements. You keep the core slightly engaged, pushing on your left 
hand activating the palm. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Micro movements. No rush. So we are working on our deep fascia, on our deep tissues, through this movement, through this very slow flow, we are going to release all the chronic stress, we are going to let go of the tension. Last three rounds. Inhale and exhale. And on the last round, come all the way up, count the stretch, rest your right shoulder, opening to the left, a couple of breaths here, and slowly release. Come back to tabletop position. Inhale, open your chest. Exhale, downward facing dog. Big stretch. Inhale, into plank. Lower. Find your Bhujangasana. Open your chest. Exhale, downward facing dog. Lower on your knees. We're going to do the other side. So right hand under right shoulder. Extend your left leg out. And from here, inhale, reach over your head. Exhale. Inhale, big stretch. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Last three rounds. And on the last round, come all the way up. Counter stretch, relax your left shoulder, opening the chest to the right side, look up to the sky. And slowly 
release both hands on the mat finding tabletop position touch your toes downward facing dog just to stretch your back big stretch inhale into plank exhale to lower inhale to bhujangasana opening the chest exhale Adho Mukha Svanasana Slowly walk your feet between your hands Uttanasana And slowly unroll your spine to come to standing Tadasana Inhale, Urdhvastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Step back to find your downward facing dog. Just to lower your knees, cross your ankles, come to seated. And we're going to lie on our back. We are going to do Setu Bandhasana, Half Bridge Pose. So it's a dynamic flow. So heels ideally in line with your knees, pressing on your palms, forearms, and also shoulders as we lift the hips up. Inhale, engage your thighs, engage your glutes. So the movement doesn't start from the knees, it starts from your thighs. And exhale to lower. Inhale. And exhale. You can start with micro movement, inhale coming up and exhale to lower. Inhale and slowly exhale one vertebra at a time, reaching the mat. Once again, try to extend your breath, to extend the movement. And slowly exhale, exhale, exhale. One vertebra at a time. Last three rounds. And release. Stay here with your spine on the mat, bringing awareness and energy to your lower back. Inhale, expand your belly and notice your spine coming off the mat. Exhale. Exhale, throw your belly in, your spine touches the mat.
Now extend your left foot out, right foot out. We're going to lift one leg at a time. together with our arms. So basically arms come overhead and one leg will reach the sky. Inhale Exhale and we alternate left and right. The leg that stays on the mat is super active. Last two rounds, each side. Slowly release, draw your knees towards your chest and stay here. Roll back and forth a few times. And find your seated position with your legs crossed. Keep your eyes closed. Find land in the shoulder, in the spine. Hands in Chin Mudra. Palm facing down or up. And here we are going to do seven Brahmari. One for each chakra. To bring awareness to this journey that we've just completed. Breathing into Muladhar. Mm. Breathing into Swadhisthan. Mm. 
breathing into Manipur. Breathing into Anahat. Breathing into the should. Breathing into Agya. Breathing into Sasrat. Stay here in complete stillness. You can meditate here or you can lie in Shavasana. You choose. Slowly return to the present moment. If you're in Shavasana, start moving your body. And whenever you're ready, make your way to seated with your legs crossed and your eyes closed. And take a moment here to Really soak up this sensation of incredible well being, the sensation of stillness and peace. Pride yourself for showing up to your sadhana, which is your physical and spiritual practice, and for completing this beautiful journey of awareness and self-discovery.
slowly bring palms to your chest. Breathing into Om and Trishanti. Om. Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Namaste. Thank you very much. Thank you for joining me in this um, beautiful journey. And I hope to see you soon again. Namaste.